augmented reality, which superimposes digital images, including holograms, onto a user's view of the world, is in the earliest stages of commercial development. The technology is already in use at a handful of companies, including Agco, an agriculture equipment company based in Duluth, Georgia. Agco uses AR to conduct quality checks and help technicians make repairs in the field. The company is also using the technology on their manufacturing floor. Workers see detailed instructions projected onto equipment that guide assembly and enable them to make precise welds. Researchers at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology say further improvements in the performance of AR equipment and reductions in their cost will drive the technology into the mainstream, specifically in the supply chain. MIT is working to speed up the process by building a multi-million dollar visual analytics lab at the university's Center for Transportation and Logistics in Cambridge, Massachusetts. Corporations and researchers can experiment there with holograms and interactive touchscreen walls embedded with layers of supply chain data. The global 3D imaging market is expected to grow by 4.9 billion in 2015 to 16.6 billion in 2020, according to Markets and Markets, a research firm in India. By 2025, more than 14 million U.S. workers will use smart glasses, such as Google Glass and HoloLens, up from 400,000 this year, according to Forrester Research.